my name's Chris Welch. I'm a professor uh, at the International Space University uh, in Strasbourg in France. Uh, and I've been here in Tallinn for the, the first uh, internal preliminary design review uh, of the uh, Tut Mectory uh, nano satellite project. It's uh, got off to a very good start. It's building on the expertise of Tallinn University of Technology uh, that was uh, developed uh, during the S Cube project uh, when uh, Estonia put its uh, first nano satellite in space. Uh, this is a, a more ambitious project. It's, uh, it's, a, it's a bigger nano satellite. Uh, it features some uh, innovative uh, deployable technologies. Uh, it's also a very interesting project because of the way that it's being coordinated across the university. Uh, there are seven separate uh, student teams from, from different faculties and different parts of the university, supervised by members of the university uh, staff, faculty, professors, um, and also people from uh, you know um, some Estonian um, space startup companies which are based in the Tutmektori Center. Uh, we saw their work yesterday. Uh, I think it's fair to say that each of the student teams has put in a, you know, a great deal of effort. Uh, they are learning about space at the same time as designing the various systems of the satellite. They're looking at the structure, uh, the thermal conditioning, the, the power, the electronics, the communications, the, the optical payload, uh, the attitude control, and they've all done very good work. The um, challenges for the project are you know, the coordination of uh, such, a, such a diverse set of students, and they're not just Estonian students, they're, they're international students uh, as well from a number of different countries. I've got every confidence uh, that with the, with the heritage that uh, the university has from SQ1 and the wide range of uh, very high quality technical experts, the commitment of the students, that we will see this satellite uh, in space within a very few years.